Hi, this is Kushbu with another theorem of Euclid's geometry. This is theorem number 5.1 from NCRT page number 85. This says two distinct lines cannot have more than one point in common. Now we prove that two distinct lines, two different lines, they can have one point in common. Point ho sakta. Chai lines can be intersect, chai can be intersect, but they can be common points. Ho sakta. Ye aapko so, you have to prove that. So, you have given that two lines. Supposingly P and Q. And to prove that they have only one common point. In case of common points, it is A. Proof. We have let that the two lines, two points, but two different points per intersect. Kar rahe. Let Lines P and Q intersect at two distinct points L and M. We have two two points per intersect. Kar rahe. So, this means that we have two points per intersect. Kar rahe. So, basically, we have two different points, hai, two distinct points. Hai. So, these lines are passing through two distinct points. So these lines are passing through two distinct points. So I think axiom for that only one point that the two distinct points can have only one and only one point in common. So if you talk about a line, kar rahe, uske paas hai ek hi. Do distinct points, if line pass kar rahe hai aapki, so, one point, one point ho sakta uske paas. So, our assumption contradicts the axiom that there is one and only one, one and only one unique line. Unique line passing through two distinct points. Passing through two distinct points. So that means our assumption was wrong. So our assumption was wrong. Our assumption was wrong. Hence. Two distinct lines cannot have more than one point in common. Two distinct lines cannot have more than one point in common. So this was theorem number 5.1 from NCRT and do watch the next video for some more questions. Goodbye.